Welcome back students, this is the professor and in today's episode of creating an online banking website using Flask, I'll be teaching you how to withdraw the money from our bank account so that we could use it. So let's head over to our withdraw function, which is right over here, and let's just copy this if statement. Just like that. And before I do anything else, let me just go back to my deposit function and I need to include an else statement as well. So I'm just going to say else render template and I'm just going to render the deposit page just like that. And I'm going to be doing the same thing for the withdraw function. So I'm going to say else and I'm going to return render template and I'm going to return the withdraw.html just like that. All right, once we've done that, let's head over to our login, or should I say deposit.html, and I'm just going to copy and paste this block of code. Right over here, let me head over to my withdraw.html, and it's just a simple copy and paste, just like that, just to make life easier. Now, inside the form action where it says slash deposit, we need to change it to slash withdraw, since we're using the withdraw function. And I'm going to say over here, withdraw amount, just like that and our name will be withdraw just like that now let's head back over to our main.py and inside the withdraw function let's change the deposit to withdraw just like that and inside the deposit let's change it to withdraw like so now the print is just to validate our entry one more time and let's give it a run All right, let's open it into a new tab, just like that. Let's register. I'm going to say prof and the password is one two three. And inside login, I'm going to enter the same details, just like that. All right, once we create our account, let's deposit some money. So I'm going to deposit one thousand five hundred pounds. Let's make myself rich for this episode. I'm going to submit my value. And in our console, we can see that I now have £1,500 into my account. So what if I need to withdraw the money? Let me go back to my website. Let's head over to withdraw, just like that. And I'd like to withdraw £500 for the new PS5. And now I'm going to submit my value. So if we head back to our console, we can see that now our balance is updated to £1,000. So that means we withdrew £500. So that's it for this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next lesson.